global presence. When it comes to major achievements, all of the expertise continually bundling the widest range of competencies to create something lasting. Innovations for today and tomorrow. Frankfurt, International Financial and Trade Show Center. This is where Lawrence Talliker lives. He is working on a new landmark to add to the Frankfurt skyline. The Marienturm, in a prominent location in the banking district. The 155-meter-high office tower is being created on the basis of demanding sustainability criteria. One of the major challenges is the tight schedule. While concrete is poured on new floors at the top, the lower floors are already being cladded and finished. Lawrence Talliker is in charge of interior construction. Here at the building site of the Marienturm Tower in Frankfurt, construction logistics plays a major role. In the congested inner city, there is no room for storage, so everything is delivered on demand with some 30 trucks per day. Hulk Tief builds the Marienturm as part of a pre-fair partnership. Construction targets and costs, for example, for high-quality equipment, were calculated jointly in an intensive pre-construction phase with the client, the basis for all work. Hochtief is one of the leading builders of skyscrapers. There is a tradition of this skill in Frankfurt in particular. The Marienturm is high-rise number 20 that we are building here. Prague, with its famous historic old town. Since 1881, this has included the Neo-Renaissance building of the State Opera House. It has been undergoing a complete restoration since 2017. Jan Krzysztek is the Hochtief project manager in the Czech Republic. With the reconstruction of a protected historical building, special, extraordinary efforts have to be performed in order to rebuild the structure true to its original form. At the same time, modernizing all theater engineering must also be taken into consideration. Up to 120 specialists work here every day over a total area of almost three square kilometers. In the auditorium with its historic decorations, the painted ceilings are restored by hand. Technical ability for which we have the experience and the right specialists. Preserving the past for the future. Up to 2023, the second largest airport in the USA, LAX in Los Angeles, will be undergoing a billion dollar modernization program. This includes the construction of the Midfield Satellite Concourse by Turner Construction. Don Wells is the General Superintendent, who is responsible for smooth operations on the construction site. BIM, Building Information Modeling, is used in planning and coordinating all work on the new terminal building. All plans are available digitally across the entire construction site and are updated on a daily basis. This airport is one of the world's leading airports, and we are facing a challenge with logistics, technology, and timing. In just two and a half years, we're going to put in 12 new international gates connected directly to the Tom Bradley International Terminal. The importance of innovation, passive daylight for the interior areas and a cooling roof make the complex future-proof from an energy perspective as well. Access to terminals will be improved in the future by means of an automated elevated railway. This people mover is to be constructed by a consortium led by ACS Hochtief. The Public-Private Partnership Contract, PPP, includes planning, financing, construction and operation over a period of 25 years. The St. Lawrence River in the center of Montreal. Here another PPP project is taking shape, the new Champlain Bridge. Hochtief is part of the Signature on the St. Lawrence Group Consortium who is responsible for the design, construction, financing, operations, maintenance and rehabilitation of the project under a PPP agreement with the Government of Canada. 
Canada is a pioneer in the area of PPP. This makes necessary innovations possible financially in a highly efficient manner. Jack Fury works for the Hope Teak subsidiary Flatiron, which is a member of the Construction Consortium in Montreal. The existing Champlain Bridge has one of the highest levels of traffic in Canada, with over 50 million vehicles crossing it every year. The new bridge with a length of 3.4 kilometers will be built within 42 months. In order to stay on schedule, concrete and steel parts were prefabricated in a modular process. During the preparation phase of the job, we built a jetty in the water, a few docks and mooring areas. This allowed us to build precast elements and various steel structures assembled on the jetty. Once that is complete, they were sent on the water to be erected. The Champlain Bridge has a planned life cycle of 125 years. It will be a new symbol for Montreal. Hong Kong Island. Coleman Wong is making his way through heavy morning traffic in Wan Chai to his office on the construction site of the Central Wan Chai Bypass Project. The project is creating a 4.5 kilometer long trunk road with three lanes on either side and a 3.7 kilometer long tunnel which will go operational in 2018. The tunnel is intended to significantly reduce traffic along the existing city corridor. One of the biggest challenges in building this tunnel project was constructing the tunnel 20 meters under the Cross Harbour Tunnel without causing any disruption to the traffic with almost 100,000 vehicles per day. Leighton Asia is the largest mechanical and electrical installation service provider in Hong Kong and is responsible for the construction and fitting out of three ventilation buildings. The project uses the most modern fire prevention technology. This includes a highly modern purification system to purify the exhaust air, the first of its kind in Hong Kong. The result will be a green urban design very much in line with the sustainable infrastructure of one of the largest cities in the world. Simic Group, with headquarters in Sydney, is a world-leading international contractor with expertise to deliver construction, infrastructure, mining and minerals projects, as well as operations and maintenance services. Simic has provided mining innovation for more than 70 years, offering the widest range of in-house surface and underground mining capabilities, pioneering development and use of new methods and technologies. White Rock Solar Farm is tucked away in the rolling hills of New England, Australia. This is where Andrew Timms works at Simic Group Operating Company UGL. As the project manager, Andrew is responsible for design, construction, operation and energy production at the White Rock Solar Farm. The farm is a 20 megawatt photovoltaic project completed for Goldwind Australia. When we complete this project, it will further solidify the New England Tablelands area as a renewable energy hub of New South Wales. It will also further demonstrate and reiterate UGL's engineering, procurement and construction capabilities to the renewable energy sector. UGL is responsible for integrating the high voltage, low voltage, control and monitoring systems into the existing substation. This integration guarantees smooth connection to the high voltage network. The solar farm provides 46,000 megawatt hours of renewable energy, covering the needs of 8,000 homes in Australia each year. Hochtief. We work towards innovative and sustainable values in building construction, civil engineering, and infrastructure worldwide. 
values that show the way for future generations. They are footprints for the future.